showing you today how to join an I cord bind off in the round. So I have three stitches left on my needle and I've cut a tail of yarn and threaded it through a tapestry needle. So what you want to do is join the stitches so they match up with the beginning of the I cord edge here. So to do that I have my yarn coming off this stitch on the left and I want it to come through the stitch on the right so that I can match this stitch with the far right I cord stitch here. So I'll thread the yarn through the stitch on the right, pull it through, and then to connect this stitch with the far right stitch of the I cord bind off, I'm going to look for the V of the knit stitch here, stick the needle underneath the stitch from right to left, and pull it through. I can let that stitch fall off the needle. Then what I'm going to do is come back down through the top of this stitch and pull it through. I'm going to go underneath the second stitch on the needle and then connect this with the middle stitch, the beginning of the I cord bind off. So I'm going underneath this middle stitch here. So three, one, two, three. Pull through. And then come back down through the top of that stitch. I'm not pulling it too tightly because I want it to match the tension of the stitches that are in the I cord bind off. And then I'm going to go through the last stitch on the needle and I'll remove the needles. Through, and then up through the last stitch on the I cord bind off. Come back down through that same stitch again. As you can see, it looks just like knit stitches. And then what I'll do is push this yarn through the back of my work so that I can weave it in as I normally would and cut the tail. So I hope you enjoyed this video on how to join an I-cord bind-off in the round.